Hey everyone, welcome back to Simple Foundations. Going into week two, if you missed week one, head on back and find that video, start your journey there. But this week, we want to help you figure out your cycling why. And stick around to the end, because I'm going to be asking you five simple things that's going to help you answer this question and push your bike riding further. A quote from John Maxwell that I really like reads this, If you can find your why, you will find your way. Cycling is full of so many things, things you can do, things you could do, things you should do. It's endless. So the truth is, the more you ride, the more you're immersed in the sport, the quicker you realise just how far and wide the sport does go. There's so many different opportunities, so many different experiences that you can have on the bike and none of them are bad, they're all good. However, too much of a good thing can be harmful to you, not only yourself, not only the experiences you're chasing, but to our friends, our family, our workplaces, all of the expensive. So we want to really be able to narrow it down enough and this is the question that we need to be able to answer to help us do that. Too much cycling can be a problem. So this is where it all starts in my opinion to answer this one question to help you push your bike riding further. Why do you ride? The deeper we can go in answering this question, the better our riding experiences will be. And it will be personal, it will be different for you and your circumstances. And that's the greatest thing about the sport, is the personal aspect of it. And trust me, it will change. I personally have gone from being a full-blown racer, all about being performance and finishes, to now, yes I still do events, yes I want to be the best I can be, but I'm much more in a space of helping other people, trying to push some other boundaries with my bike riding, whether it be with distance, or whether it's just the, the accomplishment of getting out in those dark and dr dreary days to make sure I'm ticking the box and doing the work and just enjoying the sport at a different pace and trying to help other people do it. It's very different now than it was 10 years ago and it will be very different in 10 years than what it is today. It always needs to be asked, it always needs to be changing and it will be personal to you. And do not be afraid to change. We'll talk about it in another video but I have a very personal experience of when I didn't change my why and I stopped writing because I couldn't be something that I shouldn't have been trying to be. So we really need to dive into this because it really sets up our foundation for our bike riding and getting the most out of the sport and it not overtaking us and it becoming a harmful things in our lives. So I've got five things that I want to ask you to help you answer this question of why do you ride? Number one, is your why the thing that focuses your goals? and your experiences. Number two, does your why align with the people that you ride with? Number three, does your why align and navigate your cycling purchases? Number four, does your why make it easy to say no to other cycling things? And number five, the most important, does your why incorporate your family your friends, your workplace, and the other areas of your life. Does your why incorporate all of your life to make it simpler to understand where your cycling is placed in your life and how it can be better for you? So I hope these questions really helped you out. I hope you're thinking about them. It's okay if you do not have the answers to them right now, but I challenge you on your next long bike ride to start going deep on these, start coming up with some answers and be okay to potentially change some of the things that you're thinking right now. The deeper we can be with our why, the simpler our cycling will be. So I hope you found value in that guys. Subscribe below if you haven't already and you want to see more content like this and I look forward to seeing you next week where we can put another block on our Simple Cycling Foundation. See you then. Cheers.